welcome back to my channel. I am so glad that you are here today. This review is being brought to you today by PinkyPromise.com. Go to the Pinky Promise website and sign up to receive your emails and you can get a code to save 30%. You can also email support at PinkyPromise.com if you ever have any wig related questions. So today I am continuing my series on all of Envy's 12 new rooted colors. They have these colors available on 25 of their styles. So today I am showing you <laughs> the dramatic, I would say, Kelsey. And the beautiful color here is called Honey Breeze. So more on this one in just a minute. Okay, let's start talking about Kelsey. Okay, so Kelsey. <laughs> I was nervous about reviewing this one because this is obviously, I mean, if you guys have watched my videos or seen my Instagram or whatever, you know that this is not really a style that I would wear. Now, I absolutely love the front. I wish the whole thing was just a curly bob um, for my liking. But you know what? I'm not doing these reviews for my liking. I'm doing these reviews to show you all these styles and these colors. So I have seen this wig on other people, and I want to tell you, they look fabulous in it. So it may not be my preferred style, but it is someone's preferred style. So let's get in and start talking about her. And then we're going to talk about this gorgeous, gorgeous color, Honey Breeze. I love this blonde. This blonde is so pretty. So, okay. So Kelsey, I will do a turn all the way around. You can see her with all of her drama. And then we'll start talking about, you know, a little bit of her specs and then the color. So here she is from the front. Are y'all ready? Here's my left side. Ta-da! I told y'all she was, she had some drama. The back. My right side. And back to the front. Okay, so she has a lot going on. She's got these beautiful waves in the front and then she's a pixie in the back. So, you know, she just has a stacked wave cut here in the front that they have um, tapered, you know, then they gently taper off into this pixie cut. So cool cut. I mean, like I said, I've seen it on other people and it looks great on them. So, okay, so she is a basic cap. So there's no lace anywhere on the wig, no lace, you know, part or anything like that. But all these curls and everything, she does have permatease up here, of course, for this type of a style, covers that cap. And, you know, it's it, with the rooting, especially, I think the rooting on these pieces really gives um, a basic cap, that appearance of having a part, which is nice. So this is fitting my petite head quite well, fits well ear to ear, fits good forehead to nape, but with a little bit of extra room, you know, in there to go. This is considered average and it would go above average too. So, okay, so measurement wise for Kelsey, she is 11 inches here in the front. She is 8.25 inches from the crown. She has four and a half inch sides and her nape is just 1.75 inches. So, like I said, dramatic style. Okay, let's start talking about this gorgeous color, Honey Breeze. Honey Breeze is a very pretty blonde. This is another one of their brand new dimensional rooted colors. I'm loving this line of colors. They're so pretty. I've just been really, really impressed with them. Okay, so Honey Breeze is described as a blend of medium brown and light golden brown with honey blonde highlights. And then it has dark brown roots. So you're going to see the rooting, of course, throughout the piece, the rooting around the face. But of course, you know, the style is meant to be worn down since you don't have any lace or anything. Okay, here is Honey Breeze in just room lighting. So this is a, it's a pretty highlighted brunette. So a color to keep in mind, you know, even if this isn't your style in particular, keep in mind this color if you're looking for a bronze, you know, if you wear brunettes and you wanna get a highlighted shade for spring and summer or something like that. Here's Honey Breeze in natural lighting. I have window lights that are, you know, light coming through the windows, so it's a little bit distant. can see that highlight going through there and you can see those brunettes in there. Pretty. So medium brown and a light golden brown with a honey highlight.
inside of Kelsey's cap. So she is an open cap wig. So she has a nice soft strip here, velvet strip, but felt strip that's gonna lay up against your forehead that's very comfortable. And then you can see she's got open wefts here and then she's got some closed lace. So all, you know, up on here, there is permatease. And then there's a big bump of it here when you come off of the top, which is just, this style is supposed to be a dense, you know, voluminous style, so. Then she's got the open, right? Yes, they're so hard to see. <laughs> open ear tabs, and they have a nice piece of metal in there. She's open wefted all through the cap. She has the pull adjusters. She has an open wefted extended nape so that that nape lays, you know, nice and flat against the back of your neck. So this is where I'm talking about that big, it just feels like a pillow there. But you know, again, this is a style that's supposed to have permatease. It's supposed to have volume. So plenty of stretch in the cap and stretch in the circumference. Let's look at a little styling for Kelsey. So she's a little limited on styling because I really think that her style is what she is supposed to be in. You know, she is a style all in herself. So I'm gonna tuck this side behind the ears just so you can see the glasses, but she honestly does not tuck behind the ears very well. So just being honest with you guys. So there's not gonna be any putting the, you know, tucking behind the ear and putting the glasses on, but glasses do work with her. So I'll pull this side down so you can just see that, you know, she's, she's thin on the ear tabs and stuff and the glasses just go right under the hair, so. That's no problem. Um, so like I said, no, you know, I don't know. She doesn't have a lace front, so you're not gonna be doing off the face. You could do off the face, like kind of over to the side and just leave that. That would be kind of cute. You know, what you could do is you could put some cute little clips, you know, or little, um, just the little claw clips through her and pull her back that way, but just make sure that you don't expose the fact that there's no lace front. That looks kind of cute actually. And then I think she'd be cute if you stuck a headband in her. And that's another way to kind of tamper down a little bit, you know, and hide, you know, the permatease doesn't show on top, which is really, really nice. The curls cover it all up. So it's not like you're trying to hide permatease, but you know, she looks cute. With a little headband in her. Show it from the side too. Cause you know, a lot of this style is gonna be, that's where the drama comes in is when you see that side, you know? And then of course these, these sides are not quite, you know, they're not long enough, like half up, half down or anything like that. So I think that's going to kind of be your styling limitation with her. You could tie a scarf in her or something like that. That would be cute. So, so anyway, she's one of a kind, I think, but you know, she's cute style. So, okay. Thank you to Pinky Promise for sending this wig to review for you all today. There will be purchase information below this video. Thank you so much for watching. Take care of yourselves. And until next time, don't forget you are absolutely beautiful. Bye.